Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. This is Nathan with 1G12 Gaming. I hope uh, you like this video as much as I'm going to enjoy making it for you. If you do, please like and subscribe. Today we're going to be checking out Into the Flames yet again. We are going to be doing station tours on the Canton County Free Roam map. Uh, with that said, we are going to be starting off at the Volunteer House. If you haven't checked out the game yet, I highly recommend it. It's available on Steam. So if we pull up our world map here, you'll see that I am at the Volunteer House by the little green dot right there. So this is where we're going to start out at. and I set these stations up the way I like to play the game, but you can set them up however you want by spawning and despawning trucks. So I'll set up uh, the command car here if I feel like playing as a volunteer for that day or for that round or whatever. It's a good looking SUV. Uh, all the custom skins in this game that I have on here today are going to be from uh, Evan, which you can find him on the Discord. I highly recommend checking out the Discord. All right, so let's hop on over to Station 1 and see that one. All right, we are at Station 1. And if we pull up the map, you'll see that we're in the top right-hand corner. Okay, where the green dot is. I normally run an engine and the uh, ladder out of this. Sometimes I'll back, bounce back and forth between an engine and a tower, but I'll show you the tower later. Uh, Station 6 has got a little bit of a surprise in this game, which is uh, really cool. So I hope you guys hang out and see Station 6. All right, that is Station 1 with uh, my setup. Let's hop on over to Station 2. Here is Station 2. I'll run this engine. And this tanker. The really cool thing about Station 2 is... Let me pop out back here. You have a helicopter. There's a little bit of forest uh, firefighting in the game. So you can fly the helicopter for the uh, forestry firefighting part, which is really cool. And the other cool thing about this station is, is you can check out the, the city way over there. So this is station two. Love the pool table in the Bay Area. If that's not a firehouse, I don't know what is. We used to have a pool table in my firehouse right in the middle of the bay, just like that. All right, we're going to head on over to Station 3. Look at that spawn right on the side of the building. I'll run the Quint normally out of this station and the brush engine. I really like this brush engine. The brush engine looks really good, I think. And the Quint looks really good, too. So this is Station 3. I think I forgot to show you guys on the map where uh, Station 2 was. So right here is Station 3. It's actually right next door to the Volunteer House. There where the green dot is. And this over here kind of in the middle part of the map is station two. So you got station one, station two, and then station three. All right, we're going to head on over to station four. Check that layout out. Oop, wrong button. I knew I was going to do that eventually. Station 4, I'll normally run the rescue. I'll run the tanker again. With 
with the squad and the tiller. Tiller's a good looking truck too. So, tiller, squad, tanker, and rescue. That's how I'll run it out of station four. Sometimes I'll swap these uh, station four and five around. But station four is right there, the middle of the biggest part of the city. Then we're going to head on over here to station five. Five, teleport. There we go. And then I'll bring back uh, these guys here for station five. Get a motel fire in this district, and you can use that ladder truck really well with that, with the uh, motel fire. So, typically run these two out of this station here. Plus, I really like these uh, these green skins. They're, they're really good, I think. That's station five. And it's right there. Okay, next we're going to go all the way down to station six. It's going to be right here in the corner. And this is where the uh, the surprise is. I'm going to show you something really cool here out of this station. So I'll run the Quinn again out of this station. And I'll run this engine. Run the engine and the Quint right out of here. Okay, so let's uh, let's check out this thing here. Run up the steps. Hey, would you looky here? We got ourselves a fire pole. If that's not a firehouse. I don't know what is. And you can go down the fire pole. I think we're going to do that again. Fire pole. All right. Okay. So we're going to check out the very last station, which is going to be station seven. Station 7, I normally put the tower ladder. I'll either run this out of Station 1 or Station 7, depending on how I'm feeling for that day. But I really like this truck. This is one of my favorite trucks in the game. Just a nice looking truck. Now you can set these stations up any which way you want. So, for example, if you didn't want this station or this truck out of this station, all you got to do is just click on your station number, go down to remove, and then put whatever truck you want in there. I mean, you can run whatever you want out of each station. There's really no right or wrong way to do it. Let's see here. You know what? Let's just put the airport truck there. Why not? And there you go. You want to run the airport truck out of the middle of the city? You can. It's a video game. Well, I think that's going to do it for today. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please like and subscribe. It would greatly help me out. Until then, I'll see you on the next one.